Have you noticed a cauliflower-like growth on your penis recently? If so, then you might have genital warts. Genital warts is a sexually transmitted infection caused by the human papilloma virus, or HPV for short. Hi, I'm Dr. Chan. Watch this video if you want to learn about a fast method for treating external genital warts. In this video, I will show you how we treat genital warts with cryotherapy. Here's our medical grade cryotherapy kit from McKesson. This kit uses fluoroethane to freeze the tissue. When it's compressed into a liquid, it's normally very cold, minus 70 degrees Celsius, and it brings things down to that temperature as it absorbs the heat in order to boil. There's two ways to freeze tissue, a disposal probe and this funnel. This is a model of the penis. Just pretend for a second that this blue piece of candy is the genital wart. We pre-soak the probe and then apply it to the wart for 30 seconds. The other way is to spray it into the funnel where it concentrates over the wart and leave it on for 30 seconds. The cells freeze and then thaw and then explode. Usually two or three freeze thaw cycles are required. Treatment sessions can be repeated every one or two weeks as needed. Clearance rates range from 71 to 79% and recurrence rates are 38 to 73% at six months. One important thing to remember is that since human papillomavirus is a virus, it can never be completely cleared out of your system. So that's why it's so important to talk about prevention. One such simple way to prevent getting HPV is the use of condoms. This is a simple way because it has a mechanical barrier to prevent the skin to skin transmission of the virus. Another way is the use of a vaccine called Gardasil. This is a quadrivalent vaccine that protects against four different subtypes of HPV. There's the high risk subtypes 16 and 18, which can lead to penile cancer and cervical cancer. And then the low risk subtypes 6 and 11, which leads to external genital warts. The vaccine can be given to both men and women and ideally should be given before people become sexually active so that they have antibodies available and around for when they get exposed. It's been well proven to be effective. One randomized clinical trial of over 4,000 men showed an 80% decrease in genital warts at three years out. If you're interested in learning about other different treatment options for genital warts, such as the laser, surgical excision, or topical therapies, then be sure to subscribe to my channel below and watch for a future video talking about these things. As always, thanks for watching.